discuss about food toxicology. What do you really know about food toxicology? So why don't we have a look? Let's move. Food toxicology is the study of the adverse health effects on the human, which may be the result of toxins or microorganisms contaminating the food, or excessive levels of a nutrient. So, when we talk about food toxicology, I would like to ask you the first question. Do you like to eat seafood? For example, we have crackers, oyster, clams, and sardine. The next question is, do you know that some of them may contain toxin that can cause food poisoning? You don't know that, right? Why not? We have a look for the first example. Wow, this is my favorite food, oyster. Consumption of the raw and undercooked oyster by the human will cause the bacteria to enter the digestive tract and multiply rapidly there. The number of the bacteria will be increased when the water temperature is above 21 degrees Celsius. Due to the consumption of contaminated oyster, a person can develop a symptom such as fever, chills, nausea, diarrhea, vomiting, and low blood pressure. This symptom might be appear within 16 hours after the consumption. Then, what should I do? First, you should cook the oyster properly. And do not eat raw oyster. Mm. Hmm? But why the hotel and the shop can serve the raw oyster? It's because the oyster they use have already undergone depuration process. Depuration of bivalves is a process to maximize the natural filtering activity of shellfish in order to enhance the removal of contaminants from the bivalves and prevent their recontamination. Oh, so now you see the toxic effect of the vibral bonificus in those oysters is very dangerous, right? And you know it now. So why not we go to the next example, the second one. Wow, so beautiful. Let me come and have a look. Should we visit this place? Oh, it's straight tight. Do you know that we should avoid eating shellfish that caught from this area? No, why? How can it affect our health? Red tide is a phenomenon known as an algal bloom, which is caused by a few species of dinoflagellates, and the bloom takes on a red or brown color. It is also associated with the production of natural toxins, such as saxitoxin. Which comes from dinoflagellate species contain a toxin called saxitoxin. When a shellfish like cockles filter feeds this algae, the saxitoxin will accumulate in the digestive glands of the cockle. Consumption of contaminated cockles by the human will then develop symptoms such as diarrhea, headache, dizziness, double vision, and paralysis. In severe cases, it can be fatal. How about if I cook the cockle before I consume? Will it be safe? 
No, the toxin cannot be destroyed by cooking or freezing. Oh, now I understand. We should avoid eating cockles during the red tide season. Wow, sarsitoxin can't even be destroyed by cooking. So, please aware about it during the red tide season. Okay? And finally, let's move to the last scene. The last one. Well, after watching all the scenes, you should know that how to prevent yourself from getting seafood poisoning. Okay? And thank you. See you next time. <laughs>